Hey team, I'm here in uh, Cardiff, the greatest city in Britain, um, here for the, the Welsh Games, which is really getting our in Olympics uh, Future Flame initiative off to a great start. This is what engagement's all about. Guy Cymru has got a long heritage promoting sports in Wales, and it's all about inspiring youth to take part in sports across the world as a nation. So it's a fantastic opportunity for Coca-Cola Enterprises to team up with Guy Cymru to actually put on an event like the Olympic Sporting Weekend. So we've been absolutely delighted to team up with the other Olympic sponsors to host and put on an event like today. So here's hoping that this will be the start of a fantastic legacy for Wales that will be in place now each year, which will see students across all of Wales coming together for a three-day event on an annual basis. And we're absolutely delighted to be a part of it. I should do it because uh, I do swimming and it's a chance for um, people to, to take part in the Olympic Games. Not just the big people, but to really be part of it. And I'm fit enough to run with it, so, and it's an opportunity, so that's It's like a once in a lifetime opportunity and it's very special. This is a really important event today. I'm really proud and pleased to be here with the Wales and South West team in Cardiff uh, for these games. It really does get the Olympic uh, programme off to a great kickstart. And of course, Wales and South West will be the first people to host the torch relay. And what great uh, rehearsal and preparation this is. I'm really proud of the team's effort here today. Well, I'm here in Cardiff to look at the activation of Moment One, Future Flame for the Olympics, and it looks absolutely outstanding. It is a really, really big asset, and we are really doing a great job at bringing it to life for customers and consumers here in Cardiff. This is the first real business challenge that we've ever done in Wales. And today is a really special day and we're really delighted to have each and every one of you here with us today. We're going to lay down a challenge for you. And that challenge is to develop a great new soft drink. Water is the most hydrating thing, so obviously what happens you have to have a lot of water. And water is one of the cheap, obviously it'll be quite cheap. This type of competition 
interviewer really brings it to life for them. It, it makes them understand where their maths are valuable and where their technology skills are valuable. The strategy, a plan, everyone working together and actually working for success. These are exactly the sort of things that today's challenge is all about. It's the youngsters learning to develop their own individual skills as well as team working and building up confidence in terms of making presentations in front of people they've never seen before. What did you do last time, just now? Look, compare that to that. How many boxes can you put in one case? You see how they really work as a team, you know, which is one of the sort of the philosophies that we always like to sort of um, to put in place with our employees. So, you know, teamwork, that whole ethos of working together to achieve better results. And you can clearly see it downstairs with the, uh, the groups that are going on at the moment. And like the crowd going, yes! Yeah. Yeah. Do you like that? Yeah, yeah. 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 Thank you. Uh, I mean, like, I mean, like this. Okay. We've got one qualification called work skills. And all of those skills involve teamwork, communication, meetings, being able to develop together, being able to do presentations, interview skills, all those sorts of things. So it's lovely to see those skills being practiced and developed by students through this event today. You see a sporting person drinking it, so it's good for you to and see sports. People see the, the fans person. will see the sporting person drinking it They're and drinking drink it themselves, it. and then you're cutting up, you're cutting and giving yourself two markets instead of one. And now all of a sudden your, your advert is starting to come together you can kind of see where you want it to go. Oh Sonny, what have you got there? It's just some new wicker day. It's a great concoction of the finest British summer berries. Don't forget, Gov, there's no added preservatives, colourings or flavourings. Having a wicker day makes a normal day an amazing day. <sighs> all this frankly is making me tired. Then try this new drink. Touchdown. Okay, I'll try it. Wow, it feels fantastic. That's because it contains the energy you need to get back up again. And it feels so hydrating too. Touchdown, the power behind sports. <laughs> Excellent, you'll go far. <laughs> Having a wicked day makes a normal day an amazing day. Get that berry for your fiber day. Yeah, yeah. That's cool. Do you want to change anything? Um, um, little space. Yeah, the little between space the... between them. Uh, yeah. Touchdown. The power behind sports. <laughs> cool. Hi. Do you want to change anything, or we have a... no. Okay. If you um... touchdown. Okay. Um. Uh, just, just one more. Touchdown. Yeah. The main skills are really coaching. For a lot of us it really takes us out of our comfort zone and it's a real chance to see the sort of energy and the drive of young people that potentially could be coming through the business in the future. Business experience that will yeah. help us in later life and um, something great to go on our CV. You've got to make sure you get your point across and make sure you agree, everyone agrees before you choose finally what you're going to do. To work with each other and like uh, what's the word, like compromise and I'll cal calculate the money and stuff and like um, what you need to like make the product and stuff like that. So I'm, I'm writing my speech at the moment. <laughs> now welcome to the launch of our exciting new drink called Hit that both your five feet. In one embraces the spirit and frivolous side of the ashes with a removable hand grip that resembles the cricket balls used in the ashes. Our campaign is based around the Six Nations, but the product can be used in any sport, given a global market. The drink Empire contains a rich blend of vitamin C. It also includes mango and pineapple, which is one of your five a day. To, to make a bottle. To make a bottle it usually costs 39p, but we decided to sell it for 70p because it's usually cheaper than most soft drinks. We can also make a good profit of at least £998,710. From the figures we have calculated today, it will cost 48p per container to produce. We would then sell our product to the consumer for £1.50. 
This gives a total profit of £1,844,509. So we don't expect it all to sell in the first month, but we know that it will eventually be popular. Thank you, Craig. <laughs> now we'd like to thank the The target audience is sports fans and players, and will be widely available in shops, gyms and sporting arenas. Uh, we would like to thank Coca-Cola for sponsoring the event, and we hope you enjoyed our presentation. Um, thanks for listening. And the winner by half point, 58 and a half points, Bishop of Kandahar. Yeah! Congratulations. The benefits for us, are obviously, it's kind of a, it's a new experience, I guess, and a little bit for us, we're kind of used to talking to customers, I guess, talking in our own language. So to kind of convey a new message to new people who maybe not used to kind of living in our same business world uh, is a challenge, and it's given us some presenting skills, it's given us an opportunity to work with people, um, and hopefully people will take away with them, I guess, a, a, an element of what it's like to manage a group of people for a few trying out this. Some people never get it. I think you got it today. You know, you, I started to see that today. What is it? It's taking the, what you learn in the classroom, the maths, the design, technology, the artwork, and putting it all together. And that's what business is about. And what makes it even better is you start to understand that good teams make a difference, and that is absolutely essential. We work in a really competitive business, and the difference between us and the other guy, we've got great people. Uh, and that's the message I would like to leave you today. Thanks. Look like they're ready. Three.